going on guys? Sparrow here today, and today we're going to be reacting to Forga Lorga's newest animation creation called It's Picnic Time. Okay, so if you guys don't know the story about this creator, this creator is basically Agril Channel, except they focus more around, I don't know, more mature based comedy rather than the animations that Agril Channel does, which is mostly stuff that's more, you know, friendly for all audiences this one has more of a different type of humor and kind of more adult oriented stuff like nothing like you know 18 plus stuff but just more random and mature humor basically it's picnic time well um considering this re this animator really uh tends to surprise me every single time and make me laugh every single time i have no idea what to expect I'm expecting starlight shenanigans. I'm expecting probably a picnic of some sort, of some sort of chaotic creation. I don't know. Let's just get into it. Uh, three, two, one, go. Hello, Twilight. That's a lot of notes. Or documents or something. Okay. Work is done. I can see a rainbow. Sorry. <laughs> I'll shut up. What the? the <laughs> that's a decoy. <laughs> Who are you? Uh, princess. Melonhead. Why do I get a feeling that's a reference to, uh, Avatar the Last Airbender with the Melon Lord? Okay, we're setting up a picnic. Oh, paparazzi. Uh,. Oh, we got Clark Kent Syndrome. I know that's a reference for sure. Okay, then. Random. Carmen, I got a thing to show your wings, Twilight. Hi, Pinkie Pie. What in God's name have you done? We have apple cider trees, I think. <laughs> yep, Clark Kent Syndrome. If you if people don't know who Clark Kent is, that's Superman, when he's not Superman. It's such a pretty basket. Give me the basket. Okay then. Pinky is broken. What am I talking about? She's already been broken. Hey, Applejack. <gasps> oh, twice. Get the shit out of me. <laughs> Hello, camera. That's a lot of apples. But seriously, what the hell was... What the hell was Pinky doing? There was apple cider mugs in trees. For just a minute, I thought that was... What is going on right now? Uh... The heck? That is... Whoa. That's some... Wicked animation going on there. You gonna turn in apple juice or something? Applesauce? Okay. Up. Uh, reference to uh the last round up. And I love Lucy. For a moment I thought that was an alicorn. You have broken Applejack. <laughs> Okay. Cha-ching. Wait, so is this before Twilight's coronation or after? Well, actually, yeah, it would be after her coronation because she was a princess already. Well, enlisted as a princess, technically. Damn T-word. Okay, Pinky has started early. And is being Pinky. That's all I'm going to say. Knock, knock. Who's there? Okay, we're gonna have a lesson zero flashback. What the hell? Uh, exactly, my thoughts, exactly. Okay, we've got Roombas. What is going on here? I am so confused right now. <laughs> is that a teapot? 
Okay, then. I don't know what those things were, but okay. Not to rarities. Okay. Rarity is moving out of Ponyville. Uh, that would kind of follow with uh, the epilogue. Oh, dear. Oh, no. She's taken over Twilight's castle. I don't... <laughs> oh, rarity. Generosity, my ass. Uh, <clears throat> uh, what have you done to my castle, rarity? Squee! I can't tell what it says on the mug. <laughs> well. What does Fluttershy have? Is that a giant teapot? Or something? <laughs> like I said, it's random and weird humor. Oh god, what's going to happen when we get to Starlight? Who are we missing? Oh, Rainbow Dash, duh. Okay, we have a giant pillow in the sky, I guess? I don't know. That works. Reference to, um, Boast Busters. Sparkly clean. I guess. Rainbow Dash is asleep. Ship, by the way. Okay, what a random picnic. <laughs> Alrighty. Now we're just missing Starlight. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, Freaking lord. Uh. Okay. Why? Now what is Starlight up to? That came up very Sean Connery-like. What is Starlight up to? Uh. Okay. Are we removing the wings? Oh, we've got the stringy thing. Continuity. Okay. What are we doing? It's overloading. Okay. What is going on right now? Feeding memory or something. I don't know. We've got a map. Whoa, what the? Oh my god. <laughs> Starlight was copy and pasted too much. going on right now <laughs> multiple dimensions that was a reference to the artifact thing I'm sure there's a lot of like things I'm missing that was a rock farm where is the correct so up oh, we've got the clock four seven six okay I've got to do some math I can't do the math right now. Okay, uh. So we still have the clock. Pony Life has been released, so it doesn't have to do with that. 476 days. That's a little over a year. So. Well, a little over a year? It's actually 110 something days over a year. Uh, because a year is normally around 365 days. So. All right, so that was it's picnic time. About exactly what I would expect out of, you know, Forgalorga's animation style. Well, technically, oh, damn it. Uh, T word, uh, it's Agro Channel, just, just under a different creator name with a different animation style and a different, like, storytelling and, like, humor aspect. Uh, random as hell. And kind of senseless in a way <laughs> like it doesn't make sense especially on starlight's end i'm still i'm gonna have to really do some math or do some research on this if i'm guesstimating a little over a year so about 100 days over a year which 100 days uh over a year would be a little over three months yeah a little over three months so about three and a half months or something along those lines after a year. So right now we are, uh, what's the fucking month? July. Hang on. June. I knew it was one of the J's. 
June twenty second. So we got a year, June. So July something. I don't know. Maybe even August. I don't know. This is. God, my head hurts so bad. But this is interesting. Like, I'm more interested in that clock than anything else. That, and what the hell was Fluttershy carrying? Like a giant teapot? It's not meant to make sense. I know that for a fact. What fun is there in making sense, Sparrow? I don't know, Discord. You tell me. Uh, sorry. I got casted as Discord recently, and I love doing the voice now. So, I have no clue what anything means in this. I just know it's a random picnic with random, random joking going on, different scenarios. Uh, apparently Rarity is a bitch that bought out Twilight's castle. Uh, well, she didn't buy it out. She basically took it for her own wants. Uh, but that does open a question, though. Is that where Starlight is staying now that she's the head mayor of the school? Because that is canon in this universe because there was an actual animation by Forgalorga, not Forgalorga, a uh, Agile channel made that was called Head Mayor of the School. So, it's canon in this universe, uh, not the actual G4 universe, but canon in this universe. Well, it actually is canon in G4. She was the Head Mayor. But, God, you guys get what I mean. So, yeah, lots of thinking going into this one. But, I would think that's where Starlight would go, now that Twilight is in, you know, Carolot. I feel like that'd be where Starlight would go to, like, uh, as a living place. Like, where was she before? Uh, let me think about that for a second. So, yeah, after some, he some heavy thought, um, Star that is Starlight's living place rarity. It's not your personal little boutique, thank you very much. Sorry, guys, rarity's my least favorite character. He's, even though season 7 rarity kicked butt. But I need to shut up before this rambles on too long. So yeah, I'm still curious about what the numbers mean. Sorry, Call of Duty 1 reference, Black Ops, by the way. Uh, but it's so in thriving. Like, it's so enticing. Not thriving, it's not even a word. But anyways, I need to shut up now. Um, but thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe for more. Oh, and a big, big reminder. YouTube recently made it so that unless you hit that bell icon and put on all notifications, you will not get notified by any of my content. So to, so to any of my viewers that sees this, if you want to be notified by anything, the readings, the reactions, anything, you need to push all, and you need to enable that bell. Otherwise, you don't get crap. So I figured I would just warn you about that because I was recently informed of this through another channel that I follow. So yeah, probably gonna be a little uh, update video or something like that, I don't know. But anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I'm completely, like, my mind's boggled right now. But anyways, happy horse until next time. Make sure to take care, stay safe, and stay isolated until next time.